The expansion to the aquarium plant farm is finally complete. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys just how it works and my plans for this setup moving forward. So guys, we have three four foot by four foot custom built tables and each table is on its own set of casters. And then each table is supporting a hydroponic flood drain table. And for lids, we're using greenhouse panels. And then in the middle of each tub, we have a center support just to make sure that the greenhouse panels don't sag in the middle. And for lighting, we have six four foot strip LED lights that are suspended by chains, giving them a micro adjustability so that we can raise or lower them to the desired height for any given species. I even built these custom wood hangers to suspend the lights from the wall. So far guys, I've moved over a bunch of tubs into this first container here, and this container is gonna be dedicated towards java fern and java fern cultivars. So what we see here is a bunch of java fern windelov, and then in the back we have standard java fern, and let's take a quick look at that. Previously, I had thought that I would be able to fit about 575 plants into one grow tub. However, I was off on that. Um, it's actually closer to about 500, a little bit shy actually. But nevertheless, it still is a lot of plants per tub, especially considering that I have three of them. These tubs are intended to be hydroponic flood drain tables. That's why they have these drainage corridors that lead to a singular low point. I think that my plans are to have this first tub set up as a semi-hydroponic setup, very similar to how I've grown plants in tubs previously, and I've got plenty of videos on that. And then the back two tubs I'm gonna have as soil-based setups, and I'm gonna be growing predominantly Anubius and Bucephalandra back there. In the long run though, I'll probably be setting this tub up as a true hydroponic flood drain style setup because I really do think that Java Fern in particular really likes a hydroponic setup over Anubius and why that is, I'm not exactly sure. I would point out that each of these tubs are about six inches deep. I do wish that they were a couple inches deeper to allow for taller growing plants. As you can see, some of the Java Fern in the back there is already up to the level of the lids, but I intend to grow predominantly Anubius and Bucephalandra in these tubs so that should give us enough height to accommodate those species in particular. I cannot wait to see what this setup looks like when it's full of 1500 plants. It's just gonna be absolutely incredible. Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe if you're new here, like the video and comment your thoughts below.